we have already covered bicep in our last video so now let's move on to the tricep it has three heads long head lateral head and middle head this is also responsible for the elbow flexion so let's start the workout with bench dips this is a very simple exercise that can be modified for more intensity by adjusting the foot placement this will target all heads of tricep long lateral and middle responsible for the mass of the tricep so we are performing this first so for this exercise we are going to target 10 to 12 repetition with 15 to 30 second of break in between if required but make sure the shoulders are not hyper extended to prevent the shoulder from injuries and using the additional plate add the intensity while performing this movement So now let's move on to our another exercise. The close grip bench press targets both the middle and lateral head of the tricep. And like every tricep exercise, there is high involvement of shoulder if not done correctly. So try not to hyperextend the work. Maintain the travel distance within the rib cage. Going above and below the rib cage would involve the shoulder, which might cause stress and injury. And also have a good form grip on the ground. You can also use a longer bar with a rack that can help you to position yourself and having a rack would help get a good form and good grip on it but since I am not using any rack I am going with smaller barbell and also easy curl bar because more close grip to the exercise would lead to wrist pain. Easy curl bars are great for the wrist. So for this exercise as well we are going to target 10 to 12 repetition. This exercise focuses on tricep and is a great way to build mass and strength to the muscle. Alternately we can also do close grip push up if the weight are too light for you. So now let's move on to our another exercise the skull crosser but please don't cross your skull while doing the exercise because that is a very important part as well. This is a good exercise to activate middle head of the tricep. Here you can either directly travel the bar towards your forehead as the name implies skull crusher. If you are not comfortable with this movement then aim above the forehead. This will increase the tension in the muscle and there would be less involvement of shoulder muscle during the movement. Here the best thing you can do is using good weight proper form and also have a good form grip on the ground that will stabilize you. And if you don't have a bench then you can do this on the floor as well. Bench is just a luxury. This exercise focuses on tricep and is a great way to build mass and strength to the muscle. So for this exercise as well we are going to target 10 to 12 repetition along with 15 to 30 second of break in between if required. Lastly the finishing movement, the tricep kickback. This can be done using dumbbell or weight plate if you don't have lot of selection of dumbbell in your disposal. This targets long head of the tricep and considered as a isolation work for the muscle. For great result, try to use good set of weight with a good form keeping the shoulder high as shown in the video. This can be done one hand or both the hand at the same time. And my favorite, using an inclined bench. You can just lie on the bench, keeping your feet firm on the ground, pulling the shoulder up and parallel to the floor at all cost. This will remove the micro jitters that can happen while performing the movement. Although this works a similar muscle, I can fully concentrate on isolating the long head of the tricep. So we are going to do a higher repetition of this isolation movement to fully isolate the tricep. And remember, proper form is a very useful thing that you should not avoid at all cost. That can help you to avoid injuries. Please like, share and subscribe the channel or comment your thought below. If you don't have any of these equipment, then you can also do it fully body weight and link is here. Have a great day ahead. Barbell Bicep, signing off.